Hi, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, it's been a while. Uh, it's been uh, last week I was away on a personal vacation, so there, there weren't any videos up uh, uh, since the week before. Um, but now I'm back. Uh, and I'm, I'm back at the drawing table, so I'll be uh, I'll be putting out videos uh, again uh, at least uh, at least two a week. Um, there may be more, so uh, you know please uh, stay tuned. And and of course uh, the best way to not miss out is to subscribe to the channel and to um, hit the uh, bell so you're notified about uh, new videos. Um, thanks to everybody who subscribed. We pick up a we picked up a couple of new ones, uh, new subscribers over the past week, and uh, thanks for everyone who's posted questions and comments. Um, I I hope I've gotten to them all. There there were a few that came in during the week, and um, I, I'm not sure I did get them all, but I I hope I did. I I do try to answer every question that people uh, post. Um, so as always, if you have questions, comments, uh, post them below and I'll, and I will get back to you. Okay. Uh, you're probably wondering what we're looking at here. As always, I don't like to, uh, I don't like to start these off with a blank page. Um, so what I did here is I, I started us off with a little preview of, um, my most recent big project which is a uh, story for the Betty Page Halloween special, this year's Betty Page Halloween special. And I am drawing an eight page story written by the, the brilliant, great, very fun Erica Schultz. Um, and thanks to her for bringing me on board. She, she requested me and, and made this happen. Um, and it was a real fun story to draw. Um, and this is actually a page from it. And you can see that in silhouette, by the way, is, is Betty and her friend. And there they are, there's Betty. And uh, there, those are really my sneakers that I used as a model there in that one panel. And this person sees something and she's reacting and what she's reacting to I'm not going to spoil so you have to you have to get the book um, and Halloween isn't that far away uh, so make sure I, I believe the the book is available uh, in previews now so make sure you you uh, uh, contact your local comic shop and make sure they pre-order it um, that's that's become a personal crusade for me because uh, at conventions, I always I always hear from fans who uh, they say they've missed this that I've done or they've missed some other book that I've done. Um, and these days, you really you can't expect stores to order lots of everything and for everything to sit on the shelves waiting for you. You really these days, the fan, the customer really has to be proactive and uh, you have to make sure that what you want is on order. So um, if you're interested, the Betty Page Halloween special by Dynamite, um, pre-order it, call your local comic shops and have them make sure that they are ordering it. Okay, so we will put this page aside and here is my trusty pad. And uh, for today, I'm going to be drawing Reggie. So I've actually, I've actually already started with this very loose sort of, I hope this is showing up on uh, on camera, this very loose sort of uh, orb, sphere, that will become Reggie's head. And actually, you know what? I'm going to erase that, because I want to want to center it better on the page. So I'm going to bring us up here, and I'm going to start with that orb and I'm going to very quickly throw a little grid on him like so really just that that central axis line and then a quick horizontal line across the middle of the sphere now now this is Reggie Archie comics uh, Archie Andrews's arch rival 
I'm giving Reggie an eye. And his eye, his eye is very similar to Archie's. It's kind of a half ellipse and then a very black pupil. And he's got two eyes, of course. And he's Reggie, so he'll probably have kind of a, a mean, mischievous expression. Okay, so I'm going to go down to his nose just below this line. So the eyes are kind of resting on that line. And just below it, where, where the intersection is, I'm going to give Reggie his nose. And Reggie's nose is kind of blocky. A little bit of a, of a bent to it, a little bit of a tilt to it, but it's kind of squared off. A lot of people who've listened to me speak before, heard me uh, at panels, at conventions, or interviews that I've done, you probably know that Reggie is probably my favorite of the Archie characters. I always like the, the bad guy aspect about him. And he is one of the more flawed Archie characters, so he was always a lot of fun to write. And I actually did get to do quite a bit with Reggie during my time at Archie. Um, anytime there was a, a Reggie solo story, my editor, Victor Gorelick, I think he, he made sure to throw it my way. I think he knew that I... I liked Reggie, and I, and I think he also liked what I did with Reggie. Now, Reggie, being the wise guy that he is, his mouth is going to be pulled more over to one side, right into his cheek. And there we go. The lower part of his mouth. And Reggie's going to be grinning with his teeth gritted together. Like, all, like most Archie characters, his teeth are... I don't think they have teeth so much as just one big giant tooth. Okay, now we got to shape Reggie's head. And Reggie's a good-looking guy. So he's, he's kind of... Although he's a jerk, he's, he's got kind of very chiseled, handsome features. He's got the, the square jaw... comes back up to his ear. Now I've got to give Reggie his hair. Now Reggie, for many, many years, had this hair that was just kind of slicked back and parted in the middle. And then at some point, maybe it was the late 60s, um, certainly into the 70s, he started getting a more modern hair, haircut, hairstyle, where it was kind of a little shaggier, parted to the side, and that's kind of what I stuck with. Sometimes I cover his ear, sometimes I don't. So this is all going to be black. And just like when I, I draw Veronica, I like to indicate some highlights here. A few highlights here and there. And the rest is going to be black. Okay. Fill that in, fill that in. Just filling that in. Detail the ear, a little bit of the inside of the ear. And maybe the hair peeks out behind the ear down there. And we have Reggie's face. May bring the chin in. Give him a little bit of a lower lip. A little bit of a neck. Okay. And Reggie's going to have a collar to his shirt. And uh, we 
have Reggie. Give him some shoulders here. Some shoulders there. And there is Reggie. A little more cleaning up here and there, but I think we could call this one done. So there's Reggie, drawn in pencil. Do have to ink this guy. I may just do that as a, as a separate video. Um, probably won't take very long, and, and I know I've covered a lot about inking these guys. But um, some people seem to enjoy watching that process. So I'll, I, I'll, I'll do that one too and, and put that up too as sort of a part two to this one. I also know that I, I've promised um, to do a video on the drawing of hands. And I will be doing that one. Uh, so um, probably this week, maybe even tomorrow. Um, but I know, I know people have been um, uh, waiting for that and, and asking for it. So I, I, I will be delivering on it. Okay, so uh, that's Reggie Mantle. Uh, if anybody has any questions, like I said before, put them in the comments below. Um, I'll be happy to, to answer them. Um, any, uh, any comments you have, any requests or ideas for other videos, you can put those down as well. So that's Reggie, everybody. Thanks for tuning in again, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks a lot, everybody.